Hey guys, this is me, Lordic96, and I'm going to be your host for this video. And, um, in the last, uh, episode, we, well, the last video of, uh, this, I got all the way here, um, in Super Metroid after, you know, fighting this weird chicken boss creature and, uh, getting some missiles and some power-ups. And if, um, if you look at my stats, they might be a little bit different from, uh, the first video. Well, that's because I forgot to save, so I had to go through all of it again, and I had more health, and, uh, yeah, I'm in the saving booth now, so now I know I left off here. Alright, so, so in this video, we're gonna continue on where we left off, and, uh, when I was watching my other video, I think I, I saw, oops, taking enemy fire, oh, just landing on enemies stupidly, but I believe I, uh, back down here there was a red door and I missed it so let's go back and uh, get to it yeah we're gonna be after fighting these guys again oh, joy it's gonna be a lot harder now that we're going downwards but at least they uh, give some pretty we, can, uh, we probably could just fall all the way down but we don't want to be taking stupid hits left and right so, so let's keep going do 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 oh. Don't be taking hits, man. I already said that. Alright. So, we're back. Whoa. Don't want to be having you kill me. Well, at least you gave me all my life back. That's a, This is another good trick. Is just to stay down here and just jump up after they shoot and just turn around. Didn't mention that before. And no, you're not jumping at me. Jerk. Alright, so let's continue onward. Um, so yeah, we gotta go back down this way. Yeah, if you didn't see, there was a red door that I passed, and, uh, I could've used five missiles, and I believe there's, like, a missile pack in there, so I'm gonna go check it out. If not, oh well. Good to always check something out that you miss, just in case. So, let's keep going. And, oh my god, there's enemies! And I gotta stop saying, oh my god, because I already said I would. Alright, so let's pull out the missiles. And you gotta be careful that you only shoot five. You don't want to waste missiles, because missiles are your friends. Alright, so now we have this room. Uh, we got some annoying enemies. Just gonna run past them. And we got this sucker. Who I've gotten better at. Um, yeah, missile pack, good. So, this wasn't a complete waste. It's good. Alright, so... Let's continue back to where we were. So, which way should we go? I'm just trying to think. Because there was one way I went uh, by myself in my other game, and I actually died there, so I don't know if we should go that way. I don't know which way you're supposed to go at first. We'll just start exploring, I guess, which is what you're supposed to do in this game. Maybe next time I'll look at a map and actually look out a good route. Look for where there's some good items, because I'm going to need some more energy soon, because I know I'm not going to be able to live off 99 right now. I need another tank soon. And more pirates, it's always a beaut. Beauty. As the Canadians would say. I don't need to sound racist or anything like that, because I'm not that kind of person. So let's continue on wood. And we gotta climb this joy tower again. Oh, joy. Joy, joy, joy. Let's continue onward. No, you are not shooting me. Yeah, again, just use my trick that I talked about in my last video. Uh, just jump up and shoot quickly. No, you are not living. And I'm, I wanna keep talking so this commentary doesn't sound like crap. Because it's never really good to do a walkthrough video and just stop right dead in your tracks and sound like an idiot. And, oh my god, what am I doing? Jeez. There I go saying oh my god again. Man. Oh my lord. I should say that instead. Or, or my desertness or something stupid like that. Just so it sounds funnier or better than oh my god. Like I've been saying. Let's go back up. And, uh, so which way should we go? So let's, uh, let's at least look at our map here. So we could go to the ship. Or we could go that way, which is the way I went before. Um, I don't know what's this way. 
uh, let's try going over to the right there. Because I haven't gone that way before and I just want to see. So I guess this is kind of like a blind walkthrough. This isn't really a walkthrough, it's just me playing around. As I said, because if it was a walkthrough, then I'd actually play it before I, I actually am recording right now, so. Yes. Should I continue onward? And also, um, whoa. Didn't want to get hit there. And I just did. Great. But I was going to say that also, if you go to your ship, you also get refueled with ammo and stuff, so that's always good. If you're running low on ammo, just run back to your ship so you'll get to save. Game save, excuse me. And, yeah. Other goodness. Just run past them like before, because they are annoying enemies. They weren't as annoying as they were. Well, they are not annoying at all at first. So now that you have the uh, bombs for your morphing ball, it should be a lot easier to find, like, hidden passage, because that's what Super Metroid is full of, is hidden passages everywhere. Let's go this way. I haven't gone this way yet. Do do do. Alright. So, what's up here? Let's go check out. Is this like an endless upwards? I gotta always wonder how come these platforms are just like floating in midair? Defies the law of gravity. But video games or whatever um yeah just dead end pointless fall Whee! oh okay never mind then you know, those green doors you need a uh, super missiles which I do not have and they are uh, you know, are the only things that can take down that wall or that barrier so I guess we gotta go this way it's the only way to go so this is probably where I'll be starting to die a lot more whoop de doo and a lot more enemies. Well, at least they just respond. The one good thing about uh, Super Metroid, though, is you can like shoot in all different angles, kind of like how in Castlevania uh, you can hit, swing your whip in all sorts of directions too. That's good. Because in the other games, it was a lot more linear and it was a lot harder to shoot your enemies. So, so let's keep going onwards. And yeah. Oh, oh, you're also going to be seeing one of my least favorite enemies right there. I hate those guys, because they just uh, go in the most awkward pattern. Again, like the Medusa's heads in uh, Castlevania, because they just are so annoying to avoid. Because if you jump up, they could hit you from below. And, oh my god, uh, like that. Stupid enemies. Oh, but right here. Uh, let me first kill this guy. This is an energy tank. And energy tanks, uh, nicely they hang out. Hand out one to you right away is it gives you an extra health bar up in the left corner so now you have two 99s so that's a good thing on well, these space pirates are kind of annoying because they'll block your attack so what I recommend doing is just going into a ball and uh, trying to hit them with your bombs you just want to sneak up like this and just put a bunch of bombs and boom like, oh, missed. you don't want to get hit of course you don't want to get hit. Go up to there, boom. Oh, I'm doing a lot better than I did the first time. Oh. I ate my words, but at least he dropped a lot of health. And there's a... I could shoot missiles, but I don't want to waste them. It's a lot easier to take them out this way. Oh my god. Okay, good. Oh my gorsh or something stupid. So, uh, let's go this way. I think it leads to a dead end, but let's try going this way. Yeah, 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 this will lead to a dead end, but I'll just show it off anyway. So let's keep going. And, yes, you leads you right here, and right here you actually get to see a little preview of, like, a different bosses that you'll fight like up there is meta ripley which we already fought or meta ridley and right there is another uh creature i don't remember its name and then you got a few others so kind of cool i don't know the importance of that room but it'll probably be important later on and we're almost up to 10 minutes here so it is dandy 
Let's go. Alright, yeah, they'll respawn, of course. If you want uh, energy, you can just grind off them, but... And now we have uh, harder enemies that I guess won't stand to my ammo. Which is just beautiful. And you don't want to shoot these things, because little things will pop out, so... I do not recommend shooting those orange pulsating things. As of experience, and now we are going to be going down to Brinstar. And I believe Brinstar has some pretty decent music. I don't re uh, remember it right now, so... You guys will hear it when we go down. But it is very jungly, which is kind of weird. And you get different enemies. Like, uh, they're basically... All the enemies are always the same. Like, how they move or fight or whatnot. But they're always different design. Which is always cool, because they don't want to have the same exact design, which is boring. Now we have two doors here, uh... I believe one leads to a map, so let's just go this way. Alright. I have an un uh, a random amount of- Oh, these guys, these guys are annoying. Alright, good. Oh, you didn't drop health. You drop health, good. Always good when they drop health. Alright, let's check if there isn't any hidden areas. Oh, okay. Because you never know. Like, right here, there's hidden. It looks like a dead end, but... Nope. Oh, you can go this way. I think there's, uh, some missiles or something over here. Oh, no, the map. Good. I need the map. Oh, I was right. The map is over here. So, now we got a map, and wherever there's, like, usually a little dot, that means it's a good area. Uh, like an area where there's an item or something. So, yeah, that's good. So, we'll be going, uh, right now. And I actually, I sound like I know what I'm talking about right now. It's kind of funny, because I don't feel like I would, but I guess I do. Because I've already played a bit. But once we get past the point that I have played, it'll be completely new for me. I'm going to kill you before you can kill me. Same. Well, yeah, screw you. No. Oh, wait, you got to kill all the enemies. Whenever a door is just shut like that, you got to kill all the enemies in the room. Forgot. Alright, so let's go over here. Okay. Go. Alright, so what suckers over here? Oh, this room. This room is completely pointless right now. Oh, no. You get missiles. Ignore me. Okay, but after you get these missiles, this room's gonna be completely pointless for right now. You're gonna need to come back when you can actually uh, use an item this way. So, yeah. And, oh my, those guys are pretty annoying. You can kill one and leave the item and they won't respond. But if you actually take the item, then they will respond. Which is, gets annoying and frustrating. Alright, so let's go this way. Alright, save station, that's good. So, um, yeah, why not? I'll save. Show you how it works. Boom. Alright, hopefully this records well or else I'm screwed, but I think it should record well. Or else I'll have to restart, like, for the sixth time. Alright, so we have- oh, I believe you can go down. Let's see. Nope, you need super bomb. Alright, so let's check the map. So, yeah, let's go left, because that's where some good stuff is. Hopefully. Hopefully I don't make the same mistake. Alright. So left we go. Oh yeah, it's this room. Alright. So in this room, it's a little gag. Like these enemies here, you don't have to kill them. But if you do, the lights will go dimmer. And then if you keep uh, doing it even more and more, uh, the room will go completely dark. And you can't see what the heck you're doing. So, Oh, here's a missile refueling station. So that's good. Now we got all 20, and I didn't mean to pull that up there. Stupid me. So, let's head back up. Uh, I'm gonna shoot you so you don't get my way. Same with you. No, 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 no. I do not want to do that. I believe that's how I died my last time, or I had, like, barely any health because I was being a complete idiot going through this thing. You want to... 
time it correctly so you don't lose like a ton of health. Because I believe I like lost most of my energy and that's what killed me in the long run, so. Alright. Let's go up this door and I'll do this for a few more minutes. Oh, this room. Okay. And die. And more annoying enemies. Alright. Take that, and I'm gonna kill you for some energy. Or, yeah, good. More annoying bug guys. Yeah, they were from uh, the first Metroid. Basically, most enemies are from the first Metroid. Oh my god, give me energy, please. I don't need missiles. Alright. So let's go through this way. And boom. <laughs> and you'll be in this area. And um, if you have another power-up right down here, you can uh, go through there, which uh, hopefully I'll get later on. These daggers. Oh, crap, they're homing. See, so, yeah, I'm gonna just, like, divert them. So I can get them out of my way. And what the heck is in this room? Okay, uh, so all this stuff. Whoa. Okay. Um. Let's just check the map. They got a big cavern. Uh, I'm gonna go up and go to that save station. I'll end it here. Okay, so let's go up. Okay. Little jerk. Oh my god. Okay, you know what? Screw it. Just keep going. Whoa. Oh, this is where I died last time. I remember it. It's from this jerk off right here. You're dead. Alright. Oh my god. Ass. I know I'm, like, getting beaten up by stupid enemies. Alright, there should be a safe station over here. I can actually morph. 